at Kahn High School, where the geeks and sneaks are taking on the Harlem Wizards in the game of the millennium. The Wizards are a traveling basketball team that visit local schools to play against community members in fun-filled basketball games featuring trick shots, fancy ball handling, and hilarious mid-game antics. The Harlem Wizards play for fun, but they also have the second longest winning streak in basketball history, second only to the Globetrotters. Local all-stars made up of teachers and students called Geeks and Sneaks were the Wizards' opponents. I talked to a few of them before the game. What do you expect the final score to be? 72 to 34, us winning Geeks and Sneaks. Obviously. Are you going to dunk it? I'm a little short, but I will give it a try. Well, then, <laughs> are you going to dunk with them tonight? If the opportunity is there, I'm going to take it. I, I expect you to take it every time. Okay. Final score, what do you think? 70-20 us. <laughs> Final score, what do you expect it to be? Oh, we're going to win, totally. Probably 30 to, like, 20. 30 to... Us, uh, How many points do you expect to score, just you? At least 10 or 12. I like it. Are you ready to dunk? No. No. Final score, what do you expect it to be? Uh, I think we're going to win. Uh, by at least how much? By at least 20. I like the confidence. All right, girl, show me what you got. She made it. She no made women, it. She no made women. it. Are you trying to become the first ever female Harlem Wizard? I mean, if that's possible, then yeah. Everything's possible. Well, yeah. Yeah. What do you expect the final score to be? Um, chocolate chip cookies. How dare you? <laughs> the show included brief interludes for crowd participation in fun games and contests. A delightful fail in a unique game of tic-tac-toe couldn't be ignored. What happened in that tic-tac-toe game? So you know what happened was, see how, what had happened was, yeah. I thought uh, I was X's for a second. <laughs> and then I uh, was like, oh no, I'm not X's. Yeah. And, and oh. And no, oh. No. The halftime show was a spectacular dance routine put on by the Parallel Performance Company from Step One Dance Two Academy. We caught up with them before they performed. We're here with Step One Dance Two, the most electrifying dance crew in the world. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. Yes, yes. So how'd you guys get involved? Uh, Maria, who is a S1D2 dance mom, uh, just came up to us last weekend and was like, hey, do you guys want to perform for the Harlem Wizards? And we were like, yeah, basically, yes. Every time someone comes to you, you're just like, yep, I'm doing yeah, it. Yeah, we're doing it. Yeah, yeah. yep, yep. So what do you guys got planned? Um, a hip hop dance. Naturally. Yeah. yeah. Is it going to rock the house? Yes. yes. Yeah. Is it going to be more entertained in the game? Yeah. 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 <laughs> you got to just say yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, the Geeks and Sneaks fell short of breaking the Wizards winning streak, but it didn't stop the crowd from having a great time watching the Wizards antics and raising money for a good cause. If you want to see the full video, it's now available on QAC TV's YouTube page. Thanks for watching.